Hi, in this video I'm gonna explain how to install the NL2000 scenery in FSX Steam Edition 2014. As you know FSX 2014 is kinda updated but uh, after installing the Netherlands 2000 scenery if you already had FSX install the old version on your computer you might find that the NL2000 scenery is not being added in the Flight Simulator X Steam Edition. Such a pity. Cause after uh, having this beautiful scenery of the Netherlands you really want to install it again in Flight Simulator Steam Edition that really runs fantastic. I can tell you because I have this whole package installed. So how to get started and what's the problem? The problem is that there is a kind of uh, 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 problem in your registry. Your registry is pointing to the old flight simulator. So when the installer starts of NL2000, uh, it does not install in the right places. So, you know, after uh, opening your FSX, you won't uh, see anything so we need to fix that we do that with the FSX registry fix you could see uh, a little few of that and uh, this registry fix of course you will find it in the link of the description will help you to point straight up to the right folder of your steam after installing however you know that you also get the pop-ups of temp files that you got to copy to the uh, to the effects folder in FSX you must know that all uh, if you know that then uh, you will have to copy at a certain moment when the installer is done for instance it's been installed in C NL2000 then copy all the um, all the airports copy them to your add-on folder in the main folder of your FSX scenery uh, or of your FSX Steam Edition. Okay, you will find it there, add on scenery. When you edit it up there, all is copied, then just start up Flight Simulator and go ahead and add them one by one, the usual way how to add add on scenery. You must know how to install add on scenery. This video is not about how to install add on scenery. If you don't know that, uh, then you should ask somebody to help you but uh, in fact then you can add all the sceneries and then you will have all installed so in fact that's it by the way uh, I'm also looking for scenery makers uh, for a project in Suriname, Paramaribo and uh, this is Paramaribo that you're seeing here these are also very nice little airports uh, that we installed it's all uh, possible to uh, add scenery in FSX Steam Edition so that all works uh, but the NL2000 you will have to add one by one. About the Suriname project I would love to you know find some guys that want to work with me on the SR2000 uh, scenery project and uh, that's about uh, Suriname and here you can see uh, that we uh, use this program it will be in the link of description so um, don't worry about it uh, you will be able to download it but about Suriname this is the scenery of Suriname that you're seeing this is a photo reel picture and uh, yeah I would love to create a photo reel uh, scenery of uh, my country Suriname Paramaribo and of course the airports um, in the jungle so we can do some bush flights it's really beautiful and I think it's also very possible to do a thing like that only to find the right people uh, that can uh, yeah, create this for us uh, are hard to find. So guys, uh, come on, uh, if you also uh, love to be on a project, uh, jump in with me into the SR2000 project so we can start making all these little airstrips in the jungle so we can have like real nice flights and do some bush flights. Anyway peeps, this was it. Uh, this is how to install NL2000 in FSX Steam Edition. I would say uh, thanks. Uh, thank you for watching and uh, if you think this video kind of helped out uh, of course please like subscribe and uh, yeah see you in my next video again